Um, in my life, um, personally, since I came across you three years ago, I've really, really enjoyed your processes, Focus Wheel. Most especially, I've been enjoying um, two of them. I'm just going to pull this back sure. ever so slightly. Most um, uh, recently, I've been enjoying two of them more specifically, which are... <laughs> It's all about getting things just right, isn't it? It is, especially for a perfectionist like me. Um, the rampage of appreciation is um, really, really amazing when you're at a very high feeling state. Perfect follow-up statement to your first statement, provided you are there. Yes. Because yes. if you attempt to rampage when you're not... And it's, it's because I love a rampage so much that I... Um, try to get myself up there in order to be able um, to do a rampage. And you, um, maybe in 2011, some time ago, you shared a very interesting process called the deconstruction of thought. And it's basically like going general with your thinking. And as you go general, you just release resistance and you release the power that the thought has somehow. And as I've been practicing it with my students, it, it takes the whole room into a place where we just not where we're, th we're thinking, but the thoughts that we think don't have any charge behind them. We just focus on the cat walking down the alley or the rock by the door where we just entered. And then that put, this puts us in a place where I can then go into a rampage slowly at first and then more specifically. So what you're saying is by going general, 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 you talk the resistance away. Yeah. And in that place of non-resistance, then you, now you've identified the vibration of choice, and now you become specific, 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 specific in the direction of what you're wanting. Yes. That is brilliant. It is, it is. So I was wondering if we could do that. <laughs> yes. Okay. Um, but here's, here's the thing about this, and let's set this as an intention. And throughout this conversation that is taking place over a few days, we will find opportunities to do that. Okay. Because for us to talk ourselves down, we've got to, get, we've, we've got to activate an issue which is not necessarily productive. So let's assume that we're already there, are we? Are we already in that place of pure positive energy? Yes. In that place? But are we in a general place? Or are we more specific? In other words, we're really not in a very general place. Yeah. So, but as long as you're feeling good, why not amp it up? Okay. In other words, from wherever you are. Okay. Okay. I enjoy feeling good. Nothing uh, matters as much as feeling good. I love this ship. I love being here. I love the food. I enjoy the food. I love breakfast today. I love the salmon. I love the French toast. I loved everything I devoured. I enjoy being here in front of Esther. I love the color she's wearing. I loved what she wore today more than anything else I saw. I love the people I've been sharing this experience with. I love everyone I met over dinner, over breakfast. I love the collectiveness of consciousness from all over the globe. I love that what, what joins us, what keeps us together is so much more than what uh, is a part. I love that we're part of one source. I love that we're all one. I love uh, and appreciate that I feel my source pulsating through me right now. I'm enjoying these vibrations. I love who I am. And I love you, Abraham. I love you. I love you. I and love I, you. And I love, the, and I love the feeling of clarity. I love the feeling of alignment. I love the feeling of tapping into source energy. I love being able to see the world through the eyes of source. I love looking out off the deck. I love looking at the ocean. I love knowing that source is enjoying it as they are looking through me. I love the leverage of alignment. I love recognizing that there is nothing that I cannot be or do or have. I love knowing that this time-space reality will reveal to me the details that are important to me, the details that I have set into motion in preliminary fashion. I love knowing that I've come forth with the purpose of living a joyous life experience. And I love knowing that in this expansive environment that that is a certain thing. I love knowing that all of the people on the planet have the opportunity to feel as joyous as I feel like right now. And I love knowing that they are in their own way making their way to that. I love knowing that pure positive energy is available to me anytime. And I love knowing that it's not a big deal if I do not find it in any moment. I love knowing how the laws of the universe work. I love knowing that I can dovetail myself with them anytime 
time I like. I love knowing that pure positive energy is available to all people and that they are dipping into it to the degree that they are able. I love knowing that everything is right with all. I love knowing that it is not, not my job to fix anything but that I'm always in the right place at the right time. I love knowing that pure positive energy flows through me and that I can feel it when it does. I love the indications of the pure positive energy flowing through me. I love the feeling of expansiveness. I love the feeling of freedom. I love the feeling of boldness that I feel. I love the feeling of clarity that I feel. I love the feeling as I'm walking into a room that I have the power to uplift just because of my presence in the room. But I love knowing that each and every person in the room has access to their own connection to that and that I am sort of like a satellite dish that lets them know what is possible but does not hold the responsibility for them doing that. I love knowing that all is wellness of this time space reality and I love knowing that anywhere I stand, anytime I'm standing there, everywhere I look there is plenty for me to look at with appreciation. I love knowing that once I get this vibration of appreciation going that what is surrounding me all of the time is more that perpetuates that. The better it gets, the better it gets, the better it gets. I adore being in this physical life experience and I adore being source energy in this physical body. I adore resonating and rendezvousing with all that is non-physical. I love helping them to carry on the life experience that they have set into motion even though they are now non-physically focused as they flow through me inspiring me to the behavior and the patterns of thought that were beneficial to them. I love feeling the oneness of all of us. I love knowing that there is this one source energy and that we are all a part of that. I love loving everyone. I love being in the place that I can yes. look at others and adore that which they are. I love the absence of angst and the absence of those things that were uncomfortable to me. I love the patterns of love and the patterns of appreciation that are now so active within me. I love being tuned in, tapped in, turned on. I love being who I am. I love being focused now. I adore this time space reality. I'm in love with everything that is around me and everything that is around me is in love with me. These are good times. It's so much better in person. Oh. <laughs> I'm joyfully incomplete and in the vortex. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And all of us to you. My question.